Hey everybody, here's the instructions to install the Laredo CC build on a fire stick from scratch. Alright, so let's get started. Go over to settings. And we're going to go over to device. Developer options. And we need to turn both of these on. You get a little warning here, it's normal, just turn it on. Okay, that's all done. Now, if you already have Cody already on there, I recommend that you delete it. So in order to delete it, you'll just go over to Applications, Manage Installed Applications, and Find Cody, and then just delete it. Real simple. Okay? So, but before we do that, before we go to the next step, we need to download an app. The app is called ES File Explorer, so we're just going to go over to Apps. And I'm going to hit down, and then I'm going to go to Categories. And we're going to go into Utilities. Right here. And it's right here. We're going to go ES File Manager. We're going to click on it. And we're just going to go ahead and just download it. And let's just let it download here real quick. You can use these steps also if you're using an Android device. I'll, I'll tell you when the Android device part comes. It's just a little URL we're going to enter in. It's pretty simple. Okay, we're going to go ahead and open it. I'm just going to hit back arrow just to get this message away. Okay, we're going to move over here to where it says settings. Real quick, we're going to click on settings um, and down to this logger floating widget and we're going to just turn it off. It's a little floating bubble that shows up. It gets a little annoying to so just turn it off. Hit back arrow, back arrow. Okay, and next we're going to go to favorite. Click on it, then add. We're going to go to the top box, click on it, it says path and a keyboard should come up and we need to type this address in exactly. So it's going to be h t t p colon forward slash forward slash Laredo r e d o chord c o r the cutters, C U T T E R S dot com and four slash apps A Yes. Now, if you're on an Android device, you just need to open up your browser and go to this address and you'll see what the next step is. Just type that into the browser and you'll get to the web page. Then hit next. Now we need to go into the name. It's kind of hard to see here where, where the cursor is. It's kind of a little complaint about this, but just make sure you're up in names with a little blinking cursor there, click on it and the keyboard should come up and we're just going to name it LCC, LCC, next. Now make sure you have to hit add, not cancel, but add and when it's done correctly you'll get this little pop-up saying that the bookmark was added successfully. Good. 
So now we've done that, go all the way, cursor all back over here, and then scroll all the way down, find LCC right there, and click on it, and the web page should open up. Exactly what you'll see on your Android device after you type in that web address. Now we're going to go over to over here, and we're going to click on the Laredo CC 17 3 in parentheses. We're going to click on it a couple times, but nothing's going to happen, which is normal. But make sure you click it a couple times, and then we're going to go down to the right-hand corner where the three dots are, and click on it, and we're going to put open in browser. Click on it, and then uh, we're going to use, yes, the ES downloader and just click always and the download will start Okay, the download is done. So next, we're just going to go over to here where it says open file. Click on it. And then we're going to click on install. Now when you get to your Android device, you'll get to the normal Android install menu. So it's pretty much kind of the same thing. Click on install again. Just takes a couple seconds here. Okay, and let's go ahead and open it. Now everything's pretty much automatic from here, so just go ahead and open it and just let it do its thing until you see a big pop-up window come up. Just let it go. This is all normal. Okay, the pop-up windows here. We're gonna let these little things in the top right-hand corner just download real quick. Just takes a couple seconds. Okay, it's done, and we're gonna click dismiss. Okay, then click continue. And then we're going to click build menu. And then we're going to download the build now. We're going to go right here to the one underneath the Krypton builds. Click on it. And we're going to go to fresh install. Uh, yes, we're going to continue. And the download should start. And there it goes. I'm going to pause the video right here while it's doing the downloading. Okay, it's about done downloading here. And after it's done downloading, it's going to extract and install the files that we just downloaded. It's, again, it's all automatic. I'm going to pause the video here while it's doing that.
Okay, by the way, if the screen goes dim while it's doing that, it's kind of like a screensaver. Just hit down circle on your remote just to wake the screen up. Make sure you don't hit the center circle button and cancel the download. Okay, it's almost done extracting. If you get any errors doing this, don't worry. They're, they're, they're pretty much normal. They're not going to cause any issues. So just ignore them. And I'm doing this on the... Okay, that's pretty much done. And you're going to get this little screen here. Uh, go ahead and cancel this thing. Now I don't have the themes working, so just click cancel. Uh, and then we're going to click force close. And it's going to take us back to the main Amazon screen. Um, this is on the new Amazon stick, the, the, the second or the newest generation is on the bigger stick. So it's a little bit stronger than the older, smaller stick. If you're using the, the, the original one, I, I recommend that you unplug the stick right now and plug it back in. And once you've done that, we're just going to go ahead and launch the app. Uh, right now, you haven't used it yet, so it's not going to be in the recent area, which is right here. But after you use it, it's going to go right, right here. So to find it for now, we're just going to go into apps. And I think we're going to go down to, where is it at here? I think I just click apps. Oh, no, no. It's on the home screen, I think. Scroll down to your apps. Let's go all the way over to see all. And it's gonna be all the way down towards the bottom. These are all preloaded apps on the stick, so I haven't this is a brand new stick, so and right here. And we're gonna go ahead and launch it. And just let it go. It's still got a couple more things to do, so just let it go. Okay, the um, app is installed, the build is installed, icons are loading up, it's still going to do some things here. You're going to see the little Laredo wizard icon in the bottom right do its thing, but also it's going to enable a skin. You'll see here in a second. Just let it go, and it's going to update some add-ons. There's doing its thing. Okay, there's it doing enabling. Okay, it's normal when it, uh, there's a wizard that's popped up. It's gonna end up on the TV shows menu. You see some add-ons in the bottom right there updating so let those things go if you get any errors don't worry it'll it'll update correctly and that's it you're pretty much done all the menus and everything are are are, are activated it's going to download the icons here little by little if it seems a little bit sluggish when you're going through the menus it's still um just um updating some things right there that wolf pack is having errors don't worry It'll, they'll fix it sooner or later just 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 let that go see there's more downloads happening again all automatic i just like to go through all the categories just to populate all the icons okay that's it you're all good to go um let me know if you have any questions thanks y'all enjoy